The Montana Department of Revenue, which is now overseeing both medical and recreational marijuana in the state, announced rule proposals last month, including a set aimed at defining what is acceptable advertising for existing medical marijuana providers. Under the proposed rules, businesses would be limited to two outdoor signs, each 11 square feet or smaller, and they would be required to include disclaimers about risks of marijuana use. Billboards, banners, and flags wouldn't be allowed. Businesses couldn't advertise on TV, radio, or newspapers, or on social media. They could have websites, but would have to take appropriate measures to make sure people younger than 21 don't visit. Providers wouldn't be able to offer promotional items or sponsor charitable events or sports. The new advertising rules would be enforced starting January 1st, the same time adult use sales in the state are set to begin. Earlier this year, Montana lawmakers passed a bill allowing some online advertising for marijuana providers and tasking revenue with creating rules to implement it. J.J. Thomas, who owns the Higher Standard chain of dispensaries, said he saw the department's proposals as putting too many obstacles in front of marijuana providers. We're already limited on things we can say, images that we can use, the way websites are accessed, as far as signage on your buildings and, you know, all this stuff. Like, we're already following a very strict guideline for all those things that already makes it really hard on businesses to succeed in general. There will be a public hearing on the proposed rules in Helena on August 13th. The Department of Revenue is also accepting public comment by mail, phone, or email through August 23rd. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.